Hi, it's me Tom here. I'm doing something different. I'm doing a tutorial because some of my friends want to know how to do stuff. So I'm going to show you how to do stuff. So one of my friends wants to show you what <laughs> wants to know how you use the select tool. It's pretty easy. So basically select stuff, you know, and to, to okay. So you're trying to get out of the select. You can't just press enter and you're done. You have to just you have to double tap so you get out of it. And if you want to move something like this, I want to move this, you press Control T, and then you can move it, rotate it, resize it, you know, I'm going to resize mine. And then, once you're done, you press Enter. If you don't press Enter, this will happen. So, I move it, and then I just... Like, it just moves back, so you don't want that. So, some other cool things you can do is you can, like, shade easily. Like, I use, I use the wand to select an area where I want to shade, if it'll work right. Um, okay, well, I'll just shade in here. See if I go and take this and I want to shade, shoot. I did that wrong. Okay, so if I'll go and shade in there, it only stays in there where it's been selected. It's pretty cool. Comes in handy. Um, this thing is really cool. It's like really cool. You can select things with it too. Like, if I did wanted to select this eye and this eye only, I could I could use this and color it in, and then I can go boop, and then I can go and do all that. It's pretty nice, but I'd recommend doing it on the layer under the line art. <laughs> basically the, the whole thing of it. I can do some other tutorials if you want. Just suggest them. Whoop whoop. <laughs>